All right, hi guys, I'm Jorasar here at the Intel Extreme Masters Singapore Challenge, and I'm joined here by the one and only Hasuobs. First of all, mate, um, how's Singapore been for you so far, and what do you think of being here at Cytex? Uh, it's really, really warm in Singapore, but <laughs> apart from that, I, I definitely like the country. The food is good, the people are very friendly, they speak English, what is very nice. And I've been here a few years ago for the WCG, and it's, it's really nice to be back here. Oh, that's awesome to hear. I mean, you're, you're here, of course, you're playing in the group stages today. Group A, of course, originally, you were here as a commentator. Mm. Uh, so talk us through that process. What was it like actually yesterday to be casting with Kylaris? I know you've done it uh, with him before. Like, how was that for you? And what sort of happened? How did you transition into playing in the event? And how do you feel about that now? Well, first of all, I tried to qualify for the event as a player. Uh, I didn't make it through the qualifier in Europe. So, um, yeah, the ESL asked me if I want to cast, uh, also for a German uh, TV channel, which is called ZDF. Mm -hmm. uh, so, yeah, I accepted that. That's why I'm here. Yep. But then apparently a lot of players didn't show up. Uh, and Kamek asked me if I would be able to replace one of the players in the group stage. I didn't have my equipment with me, so I was not really sure about it. But uh, luckily for me, Razer has his uh, headquarters in Singapore, so they were able to bring me the keyboard, mouse and mousepad. And so, yeah, yesterday it was only the open bracket, so I didn't have to play. I was casting with Kalaris, as you said. Uh, yeah, it was fun. I mean, we did it pretty often so far at the WCS, uh, some other ev IEM events. So it was nothing new, and it was fun again. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, you mentioned, um, of course, your performance in the qualifier is not quite reflective of what you're normally capable of. Uh, but now, thankfully, you're in the group stages, but you're in a pretty tough group. I mean, MC, of course, is in your group as well. But then we have a whole bunch of Zerg players. And in particular, I was asking people's opinions on Mafia, who we saw take out Lucifron yesterday, of course, and the local player, Yekka, who had that absolutely amazing series that you were casting against Xenio. What do you think about those two players? And also what you think your chances are of making out of the group? Um, I think MC and Vortex are the hardest opponents in my group. Okay. I, pre I guess that's pretty logical. And then, as you mentioned, Mafia is a really, really strong player. Took out Lucy from 2-0 yesterday. I still think from the high seats, he's probably the weakest, if you want to call him like that, because there was Xenio, Oz and Sting, three uh, Korean players. And rather, <laughs> most of the time, it's better to get a non-Korean <laughs> in your group. So um, I think it's okay. But it's still going to be pretty tough. And four Zergs in my group. Uh, usually I, I have a hard time against Zerg. And I hope it's going to be a bit better today. I still didn't really check my equipment so far. I'm going to warm up and see if everything is fine. And yeah, I really hope I, I can perform here. Because as I said, I was not expecting to play here. So I didn't really prepare for this event, uh, which is a bit sad. Because I, I really think uh, that I have a chance to, to pass the group stage. Well, I uh, don't want to keep you from preparation for too long, but I guess uh, a good question to end on would be, last time around in Cologne, we saw only one Protoss MC in the round of eight who actually got promptly knocked out as well at that stage. Do you think the Protosses can overcome the Zergs this time around in Singapore? Um, they did at the WCS, and I hope MC can do it again. I mean, I hope he can do it here, because I think he has the best uh, shot to win the tournament. And also, I think Lucifron, uh, has a really good shot to be top three in this tournament. Mm -hmm. And, but yeah, the other, <laughs> there are a lot of Zergs who definitely can make it as well. But it should be very nice to see. And yeah, I hope MC will make it really far. All right, well, best of luck to you in the groups. It's going to be a couple of days of explosive StarCraft action, no matter what happens. Uh, you best go get prepared. Best of luck, and uh, we'll see you soon. Don't forget to check out the other interviews on youtube.com slash ESLTV.